Let it cool down and then we will do the tasting of this delicious butter chicken mini curry puff. If you don't know, now you know. So today let's prepare a beautiful delicious butter chicken mini pie out of yesterday's chicken leftover just one day and then i've got some brown onions got some butter for greasing the pie inserts a few cutters a few tools for the egg wash the brush the cutter etc the fork and the mashed potato there's no salt in this okay and uh, egg for wash and let's start going but I have these pastry sheets. All right, let's start. We made pastry sheets and they are frozen. We are going to make around eight mini small pies. Eat this for some time. I'll prepare a few potato covers. Okay, I'll use this die and equally spread them around and then we will put it in the refrigerator. Okay, some see, time. I've done two, but make sure you put some, you know, some lubrication. Oh, we will rest this in the fridge for say around 20 we'll minutes. All the pie casings or the inserts with Use the small butter. cutter and cover the bottom first. You. One. Now we will give it a potato coat. Okay, around. Grease it well with butter before you put the potato mash in. And oh. the potato tops are ready. It's time to do the filling. You can just okay. and be very careful. Don't spread it all around. Just a little bit is sufficient. You will see they are, these are all with potato and the pastry sheet at the bottom. But these are all pastry sheet. Okay, so that's a bit of a variation just to see how it's going to Let's go. Let's put the brown onion now at the top. Just a small pinch on each one. Okay, this is for the additional fly one. We'll give it the potato tops, okay, and egg wash. Salt for the potato, so just a bit of salt here, okay. So, let, I'll show you one and we'll do the rest and then we will cover each top that way. Okay, let's do it for all. A good press, okay, just press them well. So, not many pastry sheet left with me so I've just got I will use the you know the egg wash and then so my pies are ready but I ran out of the pastry sheet but doesn't matter you know we utilize what we have and now we'll give it all a good egg wash once we're done with that we will give it a cross okay and this is for the vent Whew, it has to breathe just across and place them in this lovely pie holder baking tray. Okay, that's what we can call it. And we will stagger each one different from one another. Let's chuck it in 180 for no, say 15 20 bits and let's watch it. All right, see you later. After 35 minutes, sorry, it was not 20 minutes, 35 minutes, the beautiful, lovely, delicious butter chicken pies are ready, guys. Cheers. This is going to be delicious. The variation is this is the entire pastry sheet from top to bottom. So here you have the pastry sheet at the bottom and the top and then you have potato in the middle. And here you have no pastry sheet on top, but pastry sheet at the bottom and potato. So these are the variations. So the moment of truth. There are three variations. So the first one will be the potato. And it is, ah, it's potato, potato and the pastry sheet only at the bottom. And inside you have the lovely butter chicken. The second one is pastry sheet at the bottom, pastry sheet on top and potato. And the moment of truth, the last one is the ah, that's the pastry sheet all over. So the three varieties, and you will love this really excellent butter chicken curried pie with potato. So let me cut the potato pie just for demonstration, so that you exactly know what's going on. A beautiful pie. And how delicious it is. Delicious pie. You have to prepare it and taste it to believe the flavors in this lovely potato butter chicken pie.